Hi everybody, Chuck H here again. And uh, what we did tonight is we created uh, one of John Bedini's circuits here. This is one of his earth lights. Uh, this is the one with the solar cell with the second transistor in there. And what we have there is the 3 volt LED, two 2N222s. Two two uh, here I have 10,500 ohms uh, with resistance. We have the 1K resistor in there off the base, off the original. Uh, 500 turns in number 31 wire, the solar cell. And the thing we're doing a little different here is um, got this idea from lid motor. This is one of the uh, DuPont number 800 water filters. They're about $5 each. Key thing to this is um, taking that insulator off of it, pull the caps off the ends, unwrap that, and then uh, got to wrap it with something. Uh, like burlap, uh, as John suggested, or paper towels, or cotton, or whatever. The zinc seems to work pretty good right now, and we are using the alum water on this. Uh, we're going to see how it goes. Probably going to bury this one in uh, dirt eventually. We'll see what we can do with it from there. Uh, basically the same circuit as John had posted. You're probably not going to be able to see this. Uh, but I gave you all the parts. You can see John's posting on the Energenic Forum under the Bedini Earthlight. Uh, video number five on that. But anyways, the thing different is um, we're using the zinc here, and I got a couple others. Uh, I'm doing a zinc magnesium combination, and we're using the alum water with all this. But uh, anyways, we'll keep you posted. There's the little light right there, and uh, using the flashlight right now because it's nighttime and I'm under some lights. But when the sun comes out, yeah, it'll shut off for us. Anyways. Thanks for watching, everybody, and thanks, John, for doing all this, and Lead Motor, and uh, Laser Saber, and all you guys.